Hello guys, I hope you all are fine and welcome back to Talent Battle. And today we are back with yet another amazing opportunity. This is from TCS. Yes. So TCS is hiring for BPS freshers. So if you are a non-IT stream student, it is your turn now to take part into this drive and get placed in TCS. This is purely an off-campus drive. So today in this video, we will check out the eligibility criteria followed by a detailed registration process where I will show you each and every form detail which you need to fill so that your profile gets shortlisted and you get all the kind of mails and all basic information about this particular hiring. So watch the video till the end so, it, so that you do not miss any kind of important update. Before continuing, I want to tell you that the link you will be getting in the description box. So you just need to click on that link and you will be landed to TCS official website where the opportunity is listed. So as you can see here, inviting the graduates of 2024 to apply for TCS BPS fresher hiring. Yes, this is a separate stream. Uh, like those who are non-IT students, they can take part through BPS hiring. Okay. So TCS BPS is opening its gates for arts, commerce, and science graduates from 2024 graduating batch to apply for ex exciting career opportunities for fresher. So as it is strictly mentioned here, you can see this is for arts, commerce, and science graduates. It means if you are a non-IT background student, so you can take part and if you have a good sound with aptitude skills, you can easily take part. Okay. So you can be the part of TCS fastest growing units in various enriching roles that amplify your career growth. Register for the upcoming before 26th April. Yes. So it comes up with the last date that is 26th April. And it is strictly mentioned that this is a first come first serve basis. As you can see here is an important note that kindly be informed that allotment of seats in respective centers because the test will be taken on in center. This is not a remote drive. This is an in center test drive. So it will be on the first come first serve basis. So apply as soon as you are coming to know about this opportunity. Okay. As soon as the video ends, you just click on the link below and apply for this particular drive. So the last date for application is 26th April. That is Friday. And the test date would be 4th of June. That is Tuesday. So you must be ready with your test by 4th of June. So I will also tell you how you can easily prepare for this drive so that you will be selecting short sure. Okay. Sure, short. So next is, uh, first of all, you have to log into the TCS portal. We will log in and check out all the details. So before you must have your Aadhaar card, your name should be updated on the Aadhaar card. Your date of birth should be updated on the Aadhaar card. It means it is going to capture all the details through the Aadhaar card verification only. Okay. So all the details should be correctly and put, uh, like you have to submit. In incorrect details uh, will be leading to the disqualification. Okay. So if you are filling a blank details or any random details, your profile cannot get shortlisted for future roles. Okay. So select your mode, uh, mode of test as in center. So there will be some preferred test center list. We will check out and you have to select from that. And once your profile is submitted later on, you can track your application by clicking on the track application button. Okay. So now we will check out some FAQs, which are the most common FAQs. So uh, like here it is. You all know what we do and who we are. We know that TCS is a very big company and a very big organization that hires freshers every year. Okay. So we will check out the FAQs. Yes. So here it is test eligibility. Like who, those who are eligible. So full-time graduates from BCom, BA, BAF, BBI, BBA, BBM, BMC, uh, BMS, B, BC, BSC, Maths, Physics, Chemistry, botany, zoology, but your year of graduation must be 2024. All are eligible. Okay. Should not have any backlog at appearing the time for TCS selection process. You must not have any backlogs. Okay. Gaps or breaks in the education. It is mandatory that students to declare gaps in education in the TCS application form. The overall academic gap should not exceed 24 months from the highest qualification. It means you must not have more than two year gap in your education. Okay. Relevant document you have to submit to prove you about your gaps. Like what time, what were you doing uh, when you had the gaps between your academics? You have to prove that. Extended education, it is mandatory that the course should be clear, uh, cleared and completed within the stipulated time of the course. Okay. Like it means, uh, let us suppose if you're B.Tech, if you are doing graduation in uh, engineering, okay. It's a four-year program. So you must complete your B.Tech within four years of stipulated time. You must not take more than that. Okay. 
Next is course types only full time courses will be considered part time and correspondence courses will not be considered. Okay, students should be comfortable working twenty four by seven. Rotational shifts can be there. Experience, please note this is an entry level requirement. It means if you are a fresher, you have just completed your graduation, you can take part. Uh, like you must not be worry about any kind of experience. They are not uh, like taking any kind of experience. And age limit is between 18 to 28 years. Now let us check out the test pattern also. This is the most important thing. Okay. So this is a test pattern. <coughs> Sorry. So the test will have 50 questions to be answered in 50 minutes. The questions will be based on numerical ability, reasoning ability, and quantit uh, quantitative ability. So only numerical ability, reasoning ability, or quantitative. We can uh, randomly say like, uh, overall, like only aptitude is coming in your test. So you must have a good aptitude skills. Okay. So 50 questions will be there out of which 50 minutes will be given like one minute for one particular question. You can take it as like that. So you have to answer very quickly. Okay. Now let's check out some general FAQs. So which year of passing? So we know that 2024 year of passing is allowed. Which is the TCS BPS? When is the TCS uh, BPS uh, hiring test scheduled? It is scheduled on 4th of June. Do I need to create my profile under the BPS or IT? That I will share with you. You have to create under BPS. Okay. When is the last date? So last date to register is 26th of April. So uh, these uh, login details you will check out while updating as well. Okay. So now let us check out how you can apply for this particular drive. So yes, you have to just scroll up here. Here is a register here button. Just click on this register here button. And I'll show you in detail what are the steps and how you can easily register. So here you have to click on register now. Here there are two streams, IT or BPS. So this time we will applying to the BPS. For IT that was TCS NQT that might have already applied by the students. Okay, so we will click here BPS. This is particularly business process services. So we'll click here on BPS. After that you have to just verification of your mail. You have to just write down your email ID here. So I'll just quickly fill my email ID. Yes. And we'll just click on get OTP. Okay. So I'll just wait for a minute. If your OTP is not coming up, you have to go through the recent OTP once again. Okay. So yes, I have received my OTP. So I'll just fill here the OTP. OTP is in the form of like digits, alphabets. It's mixed. Okay. Yes, so I'll just click here on the submit button. So now you have to fill the last four digits of your Aadhaar card. So I'll just fill my digits of my Aadhaar card. Next, you have to fill your first name. So fill your first name. You can also put in the capital format. And your last name. If you have any middle name, you can just fill your middle name as well. Next is the date of birth. So just select your date then your month and then your year. So this was the method, very simple method it is. So you just have to select and click on I agree and just select uh, like read the full consent, click on agree and click on proceed. Next is you have to just specify your gender. So they have like they have they will manually take. Okay, so they will manually take. Yes. Next is a uh, mobile number. So fill your complete mobile number because further communication can be taken through the mobile number also, but email ID must be like good. Okay. It must be verified properly. Next is institution name. So fill your college name here. So I'll just quickly fill my college name. I am filling it as a demo. Okay. So fill correct details. Okay, next is qualifications. So here are a lot of qualifications. You can just select from these. Okay. So I'll just take BSc. Yes, Bachelor of Information Technology BSc. Or you can take BSc of uh, like physics, chemistry. Okay. Any degree you can fill. Okay, you have to just fill your uh, degree which are eligible. Okay. Next is year of passing. It must be 2024. Next is the source type. So you can just uh, click on web okay, or buddy. So we'll click web source name. You can mention talent battle if you want. 
like who gave you this information okay you just have to mention that so i'll fill here talent battle private limited next is nearest tcs office so you can just select from your nearest and fill the location okay so you can just select any of the nearest office next you have to just mention here the captcha yes now click on submit button so check it and click on confirm once it is confirmed your dt is created okay it means your reference id is created so you can just copy paste this reference id or you might have got an email as well okay so i'll just copy paste once and fill on continue after that fill this captcha code yes and click on next so kindly uh, enter the otp one more otp will come just wait for a minute just keep refreshing your email id so yes i have got the tcs registration successful email okay so all the details have been mentioned there also next the otp is also i have got so I'll just fill the OTP here. Yes. So I'll just click on the login. Yes. So here is the first option that is the application form. Okay. So main form will start from here only. Okay. So just wait after every step. Okay. Don't be very quick. Okay. Be patient. Check out each and everything very nicely and feel very correctly if very uh, if you have any kind of doubts please comment down below uh, while filling okay whenever you are uh, feeling this or you can get in touch with the talent battle mentors we will be happy to help you out okay so just let now next is start filling the form let's just fill the form okay so father's name mother's name date of birth house number road pin code city permanent address if it is same you can just click on yes and the contact details so i'll just fill all the details okay and i'll just get back shortly yes so now in this step you have to fill your academic details okay so we have to click on continue button so you just have to select your highest degree next is save and continue later on you have to fill your graduation details from where you have done the graduation like your cgpa your obtained cgpa you have to fill your course duration days and dates and it is a full time course next is the 12th okay so you just have to fill 12th or equivalent diploma so you can just fill 12th and fill all the details next same way you have to fill your 10th details you have to fill the permanent roll number and your cgpa and marks next is if you have any other qualification you can fill otherwise you can fill no next is the work experience if you have you can fill otherwise you can fill no next at last you have to do the declaration so here you have to do you have any break in studies no have you done any other courses no do you have any pending uh, backlog so you can fill no okay next is declarations uh, you have taken all the subjects yes the marks and the yes you have considered only marks and cgp during normal nor, uh, normal duration yes you have completed each of and above uh, uh, like mentioned academic courses you can fill yes you have declared break in studies uh, yes if you have you have declared you have not attended uh, in the past six months yeah it means you have not attended this selection process of tcs in the past six months so you can fill yes and you have read everything so you can just fill yes and click on i agree and at last you have to just click on save and continue so i'll fill all the details as well Next, in the other details, your Aadhaar card number, full Aadhaar card should be submitted now. Passport number, if you have, you can just fill and your PAN, PAN card number. Next, your nationalities, uh, like it is Indian, you can select. Okay, uh, here is a drop down menu, you can just start typing, you will get. Okay, next is languages known, you just have to fill the languages, you speak and write very nicely. Next is your language certifications, if you have done any language certifications, you can fill that as well next is the references you can just fill your reference if you have anyone knowing in the company you can fill that person's reference and you can just uh, once tell that person 
next is your achievements your scholarship certifications here it's a uh, like a paragraph menu is there so fill each and every achievement please specify very nicely if you have any certification you can just fill and click on add new certification to add more and more certifications next is upload photo and cv so at last you have to just print your name once again your blood group your photo latest photograph must be there with 80 percent of face and try to give photograph in white background okay next is you have to just upload your upload updated cv and last we have to just click on save and continue next is the application form preview here you will preview all the form details once again okay so you just have to select are you involved in any pending case so you can just fill no are you involved in any you can fill no okay uh, next is you can just click here to form preview your form will be uh, shown up okay next uh, is your TCS terms and conditions? Just read the terms and conditions. Okay. Just click on I agree. Your date, write down the place here, and you have to click on the submit application form. For me, I have not mentioned all the details. I have just shown you the form. That is why this thing is uh, coming up. This pop up is coming up. But if you have any kind of doubts and queries while filling this particular form, you can easily reach out to us on our official website also, or you can reach out to us through our WhatsApp or Instagram groups where we are helping a number of students get placed very soon. And you can also comment down below. Our team will be happy to answer all your queries. Okay. So now coming back to the drive, I hope all the doubts and uh, like all the doubts about this drive and the form is clear to you. Okay. And now I'll just tell you how you can easily prepare for this particular drive. Okay. So uh, I'm going to share with you one preparation strategy. Please follow that preparation strategy so that you can easily get shortlisted and you clear your TCS rounds very nicely. Okay. Yes, guys. So here you can see on my screen, a very good preparation strategy that is TCS cracker course by talent battle. So this specific course can be used for NQT as well and BPS profile as well, because in this particular course, we are going to share each and everything from basics to advanced level. So for, if you are entering through the BPS category, you can take out this course and use this course for your foundational training. It means from your basic level of aptitude till your advanced level of aptitude skills, it, this course will make you suitable for each and every concept. As you can see, the test is on 2nd of June. So you can uh, think that you have one and a half month left. Okay. So you must use this one and a half month wisely with this particular course where we will uh, make you comfortable with all the quants, reasoning and verbal from basics to advanced rest part you can leave and if you can if you have like for other companies you have planning or you want to learn the technical things as well you can take that course as well and it is it will come as a part of this particular course okay next there will be virtual one-on-one -on -one mock interview as well it means whenever you require a technical mentor or a aptitude mentor basically for in your case it would be a personal interview type only okay so a personal interview mentor will come up to you and you can just request for a one-on-one -on -one mock interview where on like on a Google platform like on Zoom or Google Meet, the mentor will get in touch with you and will ask you one-on-one -on -one questions and will solve all your doubts and queries as well. It means it, the mentor will be providing you the feedback as well, which will be helpful before your actual interview. Like how, what are your weaknesses? You can just improve those weaknesses by the time of your actual interview. So as you can see on my screen, all the previous NQT questions will be covered in the form of live and recorded classes. Okay. And there will be 400 plus hours of video content plus quant reasoning and verbal each and everything will be covered. All the important topics will be covered. There will be five TCS specific mock tests as well. And there will be separate doubt discussion groups where you can post your queries, which the mentors will be answering to you and industry level recognition certificate will be provided to each and every participant of this particular course. As you can see, there are a number of success stories where the students have got placed and more than 97% uh, there is a selection ratio. It means more than 97.5% of talent vital students, those who are pursuing this TCS and QT cracker course are clearing their NQT and getting placed in TCS. So there are a number of uh, TCS success stories, which you can check out here. And later on, you can also preview this complete file. And here is the video by Ajinke sir, where they have deeply discussed what are the course contents and how you can access to this dashboard.
So price is one triple nine and discount coupon is also applicable. I'll mention the discount coupon in the description box. So go check out the same link in the description box as well. And this was till today and this was uh, in today's video. Hope you like the video and apply to this profile very soon before it gets filled. Till then stay tuned. Bye-bye.